So kale is one of the best winter vegetables to grow in a winter greenhouse. And you know, kale does well in the cold winter growing months. And there are several varieties of kale that do better in the winter greenhouse than others. And I will share with you those varieties and four secrets to getting them through the coldest nights. Hello, my name is Lynn Gillespie, creator of the High Performance Greenhouse eCourse and Greenhouse and Garden Advisor for the Grow Network. And I've been growing kale in my five greenhouses in the Rocky Mountains for over 37 years. And we harvest kale actually 52 weeks out of the year from these greenhouses. Now growing kale in your greenhouse is easy if you know what variety to choose. And there are also a few garden skills to get your kale through the coldest nights. So we're gonna get started with the varieties to grow. So there are four main types of kale that we can grow. The first one is ornamental kale, and this is used as a flower. Now this type is edible, but is not a favorite for eating. The best edible varieties are curly, lacinato, and napas. All of these varieties are cold hardy. Now I love a very tender, mild flavor, small leafed kale. So I grow the napas type and its name is Red Russian. Now this kale will grow year round in temperatures as low as 10 degrees Fahrenheit. And I've grown them in temperatures as high as 106 degrees Fahrenheit. This thing is a true workhorse. Now getting the right variety is the first step to winter kale success in our greenhouse. So here are my four secrets to keeping the kale thriving through the coldest nights without heating the greenhouse. All right, number one is plant before the day length gets too short. You're gonna wanna establish plants before the night gets too cold. So try getting your kale planted after the summer heat has subsided, but before the day length gets too short. Mid-September to mid-October is usually a good window. Number two, keep them on the dry side. So when the plant is waterlogged, it's natural antifreeze system, it's diluted, and the plant has a better chance of frost damage if the plant is too wet. So my watering philosophy in the winter is only water when absolutely necessary. You know, you're gonna be really surprised as to how long a mature kale plant can go without needing to be watered. You know, sometimes it's as long as three to four weeks between waterings for my plants. Okay, number three is low tunnels or cold frames. And I will make a low tunnel or cold frame inside my greenhouse over each bed. This way I can cover each bed at night if the temperature is going to dip below 20 degrees Fahrenheit. This is a temperature that kale leaves can start to get frost damage on the tips of the leaves. Now, before we get to the last secret to keeping kale thriving through the winter, I want to invite you to enroll in our high performance greenhouse e-course. Now in this course, we teach you what type and size of greenhouse that you will need, how to plant it for the most food production and what plant varieties to grow in your greenhouse and so much more. So if you wanna learn more about the eCourse and get a special coupon just for our YouTube viewers, you can find this in the description below the video. All right, number four is insulative covers. Over the low tunnels, I add a one layer of 1.5 ounce insulative cover for each 10 degree drop in temperature below freezing. For example, if it's predicted to go to 22 degrees Fahrenheit, I will put on one layer. If it's predicted to go to 12 degrees Fahrenheit, I will put on a second layer of the 1.5 ounce frost blankets. Two layers is about maximum for protection. And you wanna be sure to remove the cover during the day so the plants get light and the air in the soil can warm up. If you choose the right variety of kale to grow, cover the beds in your greenhouse with insulative covers. You can grow tons of kale during the cool season in your greenhouse. If you'd like to learn the best varieties of broccoli to grow in your greenhouse in the winter, click here to go to the video.